Hello, this is Hoffman Trifle Production with another Blender quick tip. And in this quick tip, I'm going to introduce you guys to an add-on that's free called the Rando Grid. And what the Rando Grid is, is just an add-on that's free, as I mentioned before, that helps you lay out pipes in Blender. Uh, there's no one that I did a while ago called the Pipe Raider, which is a lot better than Rando Grid. But with Rando Grid, the difference is Rando Grid helps you lay out a multitude of pipes a lot faster with just one click of, of the button now I'm going to leave a uh, the link of the download in the description below this video but once you open up the download it's just the same process this is the site where it is you just click on code and from here it's going to have an option for open up with github desktop or download zip just click on download zip once it's been downloaded onto your computer uh, I'm using blender Two point, it's got to be 2.82. So you go to Edit, Preferences, Install, and you just navigate to where you've installed it. I've already done all that. And once you've done that, you click on Install Add on. And then let me type in the add on here. And you just put a check in the box there and it activates it. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> We're going to delete this cube here. Let's delete on our keyboard. And we're just going to go to our tool shelf here, and it's right at the bottom because it's the latest install. Click on that. You have a lot of options here for the number of lines, number of steps, line steps, the offset, the width, and the height. And I've seen from my own testing that uh, for the most part, these options, the way they are, are fine like as they are. Uh, you can increase the number of lines, which is the number of pipes, but 150 is pretty much a good amount. And then once you, you're satisfied with these uh, options here, the way they are, just click on Create Random Grid Lines and click on that. And you can see it creates this system of pipes in Blender. And they're low poly. You can increase the uh, smoothness of them by pressing W on your keyboard. And Shade Smooth, and it makes them smoother. And the thing with these pipes is that they're not, at this point, they're not a mesh, that they're just uh, curves, which is indicated here. And here also, this is the symbol for a curve in Blender. And to turn them into uh, an actual mesh, just go to Object, Convert to Mesh from Curves, and they'll turn it to curve, or turn the curves into a mesh. But yeah, it's it creates pipes quickly. A piping system quickly but unlike the pipe raider it doesn't create couplings or doesn't have the option for couplings or or uh, elbow elbow add-ons or uh, couplings or caps or flanges nothing like that it's just pipes that's pretty much all it is so if you want to create a really intricate or uh, I guess dense piping system you can use the pipe, the uh, Randall Grid add-on, which is good for that. And it, it's, it's good in the sense also that it doesn't slow down your, your uh, user interface either. It's actually running, running pretty smooth at 150 pipes. If, obviously, if you, if you increase this number, it'll, be, you know, it'll, it'll cause your user interface and blend, Blender to lag. So that can't happen. But in general, this is just a Blender quick tip to be uh, showcase the rando grid add-on and it's not as good as a pipe writer but in terms of making a piping system quickly with one click of a button this is the option for you if you want to uh, have a more detailed piping system with flanges and with uh, couplings and elbow joints things like that use a pipe writer I'll leave a, uh, a card on this video uh, linking to the pipe writer add-on but yeah, this is a Blender quick tip for the uh, Randall Grid and on. I hope it was helpful for those who are watching. And once again, I really appreciate you guys who have been watching the videos. Thank you guys who have subscribed in the past. Those of you who are subscribing now and those of you who will subscribe in the future, really appreciate you guys. And I will see you guys on the next one. All right, adios.